Let's now look at the latest as far as the fake fertilizers scandal is concerned. And Deputy President Rigati Gashangwa now says only a consignment of 50,000 bags of the substandard fertilizer was distributed across the country by rogue suppliers. While addressing over 400 members of the diaspora community in Kigali, Rwanda on Saturday night, who raised concerns over the fake fertilizer scandal, Ashago said police have already commenced investigations and that all those involved in the scam will be prosecuted. The deputy president also gave an assurance to the diaspora community that the challenge of processing passports will be resolved within 45 days as the government is in the process of acquiring modern printing equipment. Ashago, who is in Rwanda to attend the 30th commemoration of the 1994 genocide, urged Kenyans living in the country to invest back home, especially in the housing program. We have imported over 4 million bags of fertilizer. So only 50,000 you got a crooked supply. Just the way you have a few people here in prison. So out of the many suppliers who are given, only one with only 50,000 bags brought something that is not acceptable. But if you look at the percentage, it's actually negligible. We are not saying it is right, it is very wrong, it's unacceptable. And our security and investigative agencies have swung into action and people will go to court. But that, those 50,000 bags cannot interfere with our food security because the percentage is little.